as part of the fire safety apprenticeship, the training we have, we go to college every two weeks down to Durham and we learn lots there. The rest of the time we go out with our line managers or mentors and shadow them on audits where they help guide us through what they do, why they do it, just for when we do that in the future. So I have two ways of support, so either from my line manager and mentor or through the council and the apprentice team. Uh, so I feel very supported and if I have any problems it's really easy for me to go and get some help and support. My colleagues are absolutely great to work with, I've become part of a great team, even my small team and as a council as a whole. They're very supportive of us all and they're always there for us and giving us advice. So I just want to keep developing, I don't want to stop. I found this is such an interesting area for me and I just want to develop and develop and hopefully in the future, you, just, you never know, maybe run the department, you never know what the future holds. <laughs> Going to Durham has its perks. So down there we work with 11 firefighters from Durham that are also doing this and it's great. We see lots of different people. We also see how other fire services work and I met loads of people and, you know, could make friends for life. I think the apprentice team has gone and really pushed me and allow me to do that. I think it's a great opportunity and that has given me the progression in the council to go as far as I can as a person and they will always be there to support me.